All right, thank you, Chastity. And you know, the wait is over for more than 200 students and staff at Cal Sediva Elementary School. They now have a new multi million dollar facility that can accommodate up to 500 students. Fox News reporter Candace Murphy found out what makes this school so unique. It's more than just a new building for the students and staff who walk the halls of Cal Sediva Elementary School. When you say the name Cal Sediva, you say a community, you say a family. Everybody who knows the name Cal Sediva will tell you that that is a very close knit, loving, family oriented community, and the school is the nucleus of this community. The new school is equipped with a gym and a stage. At the old school, those amenities weren't available. Here at the old school, the kids had to come outside if they wanted to use the restroom. But now all the restrooms are located indoors, which means less interruption in class time, and the kids don't have to bundle up just to go outside for a few minutes. They can focus. They don't have to worry about battling the elements of no heat in the classrooms or no air conditioners in the classrooms. They can come here, they can focus, they can just be gung-ho about learning and about academics. The community's culture and history is integrated into the structure of the school from the floor to the walls in the gym and the cafeteria. Native American Studies teacher Nicole Williams says it's all part of their Choctaw heritage. As a Native American interpreter, it's my job, but outside of my job, this is my community. And my heart is here. William said it was hard to say goodbye to the old school, but she couldn't be happier for her colleagues and the students who get to work and learn at the new state of the art facility. I just am so grateful for this opportunity and so amazed at our children and the teachers and the staff. And we welcome our new principal, Ms. Hitson, with open arms. We know that she's going to do a great job here at Cal Steve. Good job. Reporting in Mount Vernon, Candace Murphy, Fox 10 News. The new school is 58,000 square feet and is equipped with a tornado shelter.